All right, we'll have Pat Gallen coming in later on to have more on the birds' disappointing loss later in the show. Meanwhile, frustrations boiled over in the stands at Lincoln Financial Field. CBS News Philadelphia reporter Marcella Bayetto spoke to fans about how they're dealing with their loss. The Eagles' final game of 2023 was a tough one to watch for fans who packed yards brewing company in Northern Liberties. They're not very good right now, so, but go birds. Honestly, coming off of all the losses too, it was important to have like something to hold on to for fans, and it's just sad. The birds fell to the Arizona Cardinals 35 to 31. I thought we would have a huge win, and 2023 would be behind us. Fans were glued to the TV screens during each play, only to break away after a touchdown. Not over till it's yeah. over. In between high fives, fans celebrated the hopeful first half with drinks, but then came the frustration. They were up decently at half, and then at second half was trash. As we inch closer to 2024 and the postseason, fans have a long list of New Year's resolutions for the Eagles as they end the year with a loss. I think they just need to work on the fundamentals, you know, run the ball well, complete the passes, uh, don't go for anything too fancy. For the Eagles, they need to figure out their defense and um, also figure out their offense and also figure out their special teams and also get better. But some are entering the new year with some optimism. No New Year's resolution needed. Philly's going to come back. I'm not worried. Now the Eagles will get their first try to work on those New Year's resolutions come 2024 as they take on the New York Giants this coming Sunday. In Northern Liberties, Marcella Bayetto, CBS News, Philadelphia.